welcome to my next lecture in today's lecture i am going to solve examples in laplace equation in the previous class we have discussed the five point formula for uh, laplace equation five point formula and the diagonal five point formula those two we have discussed uh, for uh, odd square meshes and even square meshes now example is solve u x x plus u y y equal to zero for the square mesh with boundary values as given the iterate till the mesh values are correct two decimal places given boundary conditions are square meshes are this so we need to find find u1 u2 u3 u4 boundary conditions are 0 0 0 1 and 0 0 0 1 2 2 2 and here also 1 2 2 yes these are all boundary conditions yes now our aim is to find u1 u u3 u4 solution given laplace equation is uxx plus uyy equal to 0 and the condition is given in the mesh I'm, i am i have written it here so our aim is to find these u1 u2 u3 u4 so now let us start what we are going to use now one you might have observed which type of mesh it is it is a nine square mesh yes how many squares you have one two three four five six seven eight nine nine square mesh to find u1 u2 u3 u4 we need to use five standard five point formula yes how you are going to use standard five point formula what is the procedure if i want to find u1 u1 is equal to 1 by 4 times it's a left value plus right value plus per value plus lower value this is a formula simple yes so we know that u1 is equal to 1 by 4 u1 left value is 0 right value is u2 upper value is 2 and lower value is u3 yes now take 4 to lhs 4 u1 equal to 0 plus u2 plus 2 plus u3 i want simultaneous equation is yes. we will write it as 4 u1 minus u2 minus u3 equal to is yes. call this as equation 1 still call this as equation 1 now in the same way find u2 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 equal to 1 by 4 times so u2 is here yes u2 left value u1 right value 2 upper value 2 lower value u so 1 by 4 times u1 plus 2 plus 2 plus u4 so what happens 4 times u2 is equal to u1 plus u4 plus 4 yes for take this to LHS minus u1 plus 4u2 minus u4 equal to 4. Call this as equation. Now, third one third one u3 u3 is 1 by 4. So here it is u3 yes u3 left value 0 u4 right value upper value u1 and 0 now it is 0 plus u4 plus upper value u1 lower value 0 yes so it is equal to 1 by 4 that so this is equal to 4 times u3 
4 times u3 equal to u4 plus u1. Yes, or you will write it as take this all terms to LHS minus u1 plus 4u3 minus u4 equal to 0. We don't have any constant. Equation 3. Now, lastly, we left with u4. Find u4. For u4, just observe the mesh. u4 is equal to 1 by 4. For u4, left value is u3, right value is 2, upper value is u2, lower value is 0. So, this implies 4 times u4 equal to u3 plus u2 plus or you can write it as minus u2 minus u3 plus 4u4 is equal to 2. Call this as equation 4. You have a 4 simultaneous equation. Now using them we need to find u1, u2, u3, u4. So for that first what will we do? We will add, so add equation 1 and here or the equation 2. So the equation 1 is you have 4 u1 minus u2 minus u3 equation 2 minus u1 plus u2 4 u2 minus u4 as you have minus 4 minus u1 here 4 u1 so you need to multiply equation 2 with 4 and add because you have minus as you know how to solve simultaneous equation 4 times equation 2 hmm? so we get when you simplify it you will get equation as 15 u2 minus u3 minus u4 u4 equal to 18. Call this as equation 5. All of you know how to solve simultaneous equations. Yes, that's why I am writing the answer directly. Now, subtract equation 2 and 3. Equation 2 and 3. Why? Equation 2, you have minus u1. Equation 3, you have minus u1. Minus u4, minus u4. Yes, both are common. When we add them, uh, subtract them, this becomes positive. So, both the terms will get cancelled. Yes. So, it becomes. So, you put them. This 4u2 minus 4u3 equal to yes. now dividing by 4 u2 minus u3 equal to 1 call this as equation 6 by dividing 4 yes to compare now use equation 5 and 6 to find the value of u2 u3 u4 u 6 can be written as to equate with this u2 minus u3 plus 0 u4. We don't have u4 term equal to 1. Hmm? Now use the scientific calculator and put the simultaneous equation. Then you are going to get the values as u2 as 1.50, u3 as 0.50, u4 as 1.00. Yes. Now we need u1. Then put values in equation 1. So we get equation 1 is 4u1 minus u2 minus u3 equal to 1 by 2. Yes. Or else I want u1 directly, you can use u1 expression. Then, directly I will use u1 expression that is 1 by 4. What is that? u2 plus u3 plus 4. 
one term is zero there. So one by four, u two is one point five, u three is point five plus two. So when you simplify, you'll get you'll get u one as one point zero zero. Therefore, required values u one is 1.00, u2 1.50, u3 0.50, and u4 1.00. Now we'll substitute those values in your mesh. Yes. What we have got u1 is u1 equal to 1.00, u2 is 1.50, u3 is 0.50, and u4 is 1.00. Yes, this is the required answer. In the next class, I am going to solve one more example. Till then, practice examples like this. If you have any doubts, please comment in the comment box. Do subscribe my channel, follow this, and support. Till then, take care. Thank you.